Thomas. Uh, I was privileged to be uh, a Dea Ade Stipendiatin uh, first in 1989 to, to 90 as a scholar in, uh, in cello studies at the Hochschule für Musik Detmold. Yeah. Of course, I think what is important is, is not the external. Yeah, it is more coming from me going out rather from out going inside. It, it expanded my perspective in being a musician. Yeah, it is not really a matter of I, uh, I went abroad so that I could have, uh, I could be promoted or, or have more. Uh, oh, that's for my belief is that that comes along with it. Fantastic experience because uh, it was like Himmel for, for a musical, uh, the, the ish uh, to, to go into the rehearsals of the Berlin Philharmonic. Claudio Abado was there, the legend, Simon Rattel, all the soloists, uh, the concert house. I mean, Berlin is like, uh, uh, for a musical, it's like Himmel in Elde. <laughs> and uh, that is one thing I've learned about about uh, German German culture, European culture. You know the value for heritage, the cultural heritage, the intellectual heritage. Uh, with the with the everyone I know who are German friends, German friends are friends for life, even though you don't see each other. Well, of course, in my first trip in Germany, the, the memorable was the fall of the, the wall. You know, somebody living in the Philippines, it's very hard to understand what Berlin Wall means. Uh, it's very hard to understand the, the after effect of the world war, the proxy wars, etc., etc. It reminded me of the struggle of the Filipino people during 1986. It was amazing because I saw the old Berlin, at least even though in one day, and I saw the new Berlin. I saw the old Germany, and then I saw the... Since then, I always follow news in, in Europe. Yeah. Some habits. I brought home some habits. Uh, uh, some peculiar, like, like breakfast. You know, the taste for... Uh, the jam, the fruit jam, you know, uh, sometimes I only have one fruit jam for that I have to finish. Now I have three fruit jams that I, uh, the, the, the fancy for bread, you know, you know that in the Philippines, there is only one kind of bread, the white bread. <laughs> the fancy for cheese. Yeah, I learned how to appreciate more coffee. Wine, yeah, yeah, so this is... <laughs> I regretted not going into the, at the back of Goethe Institute, Freiburg, there is a, there is a club of, uh, of punk. I regretted not exploring, uh, <laughs> Directly at the back of a, uh, there is like a club of, uh, because I always see them with tattoos and everything with the, you know, uh, I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm too busy uh, practicing and learning the German language. Mm -hmm.